Watermelons are a logistics nightmare. They're 92% water, incredibly fragile, and can burst under pressure. Yet 5 billion of them are transported across the world every year. But how do you move something so heavy and perishable across thousands of miles without it spoiling? Timing is everything. A single delay can turn entire shipments unsellable. From shock-resistant crates to refrigerated ships, this is the incredible journey of the world's most challenging fruit to transport. Under the relentless summer sun, in fields stretching for miles, the life of a watermelon begins. It thrives in warm, dry climates where temperatures hover between 25 and 30 degrees Celsius, 77 to 86 degrees Fahrenheit, soaking up the heat that gives it its signature sweetness. The world's biggest watermelon fields are found in China, Turkey, India, Brazil, and the United States, with China alone producing over 60 million tons of watermelons annually, more than the rest of the world combined. Yet, surprisingly, China exports only a fraction of its harvest, with most watermelons traveling across Europe, the Middle East, and North America from countries like Turkey, Mexico, and Spain. Unlike apples or bananas, which continue to ripen after picking, watermelons are non-climacteric, meaning they must be harvested at the perfect moment. Pick them too soon, and they remain bland and flavorless. Too late, and they overripen, becoming soft and unsellable. This is why harvesting a watermelon is an art. Under the scorching sun, a farmer kneels beside a plump green melon, tapping its surface with calloused fingers, listening for the deep, hollow echo that signals ripeness. He tilts it slightly, inspecting the golden patch where it kissed the earth, ensuring it has soaked up just enough warmth to reach peak sweetness. Some farmers still trust their instincts, while others now use bricks meters, precision tools that measure sugar levels with laser-like accuracy. But as farms scale up, technology is stepping in. Some growers now use AI-powered optical sensors that scan watermelons for internal ripeness and sugar concentration. These machines can analyze thousands of melons per hour, replacing traditional hand inspections. Once a melon is deemed ready, it's carefully cut from the vine, never pulled, to avoid internal damage. From the moment a watermelon is harvested, the countdown begins. Unlike many fruits, which can be stored for months in cold warehouses, watermelons have a short post-harvest life of just two to three weeks before their quality declines. Their high water content makes them extremely sensitive to temperature fluctuations, and even a small drop below 10 degrees Celsius 50 degrees Fahrenheit can cause chilling injury, leading to watery, flavorless flesh. But the biggest risk? Bruising. Despite their tough outer rinds, watermelons are deceptively fragile. A single bump or excessive vibration during transport can cause internal cracks that may not be visible until the fruit is sliced open. To prevent this, watermelons are placed in padded bins lined with foam or straw, and in some cases, carefully hand-wrapped in protective netting. Stacking is another challenge. Too much weight on the bottom melons can lead to crushing, so workers meticulously arrange them in single or double layers within crates, ensuring stability while minimizing pressure. Once harvested and sorted by size and quality, watermelons must reach markets quickly. In major growing regions like Mexico and the US, melons are loaded onto ventilated trucks, often equipped with soft flooring to reduce impact during transit. These trucks operate under strict time frames. Within 24 to 48 hours, the fruit must reach distribution centers where they are inspected, labeled, and rerouted to their final destinations. But this is just the first leg of the journey. The real logistical challenge begins when watermelons cross borders and oceans, traveling thousands of miles to reach consumers in distant markets. Transporting a watermelon isn't just about moving fruit. It's about overcoming weight, fragility, perishability, and border restrictions all at once. Unlike grains or packaged foods, watermelons demand constant care to prevent bruising, cracking, and spoilage. Even the smallest oversight in stacking, temperature control, or timing can turn an entire shipment into thousands of pounds of wasted fruit. Weighing up to 20 pounds each, watermelons are among the heaviest fruits in commercial agriculture. A single 40-foot container holds just 20 to 22 tons, far less than apples or bananas, driving up transportation costs. But weight isn't the only issue. Improper stacking can crush lower layers into pulp. In the past, overloaded trucks arrived at markets only for workers to find a disaster of split rinds and wasted fruit. 
Today, air cushion trailers and ventilated crates help distribute weight evenly, preventing damage and maximizing transport efficiency. Watermelons have a short shelf life and require careful temperature control. Storing them below 10 degrees Celsius 50 degrees Fahrenheit can cause chilling injury, which ruins their texture and flavor. However, if stored above 15 degrees Celsius 59 degrees Fahrenheit, they start to deteriorate too quickly. Refrigerated shipping containers, reefers, are used for long-distance transport, maintaining temperatures between 10 to 15 degrees Celsius 50 to 59 degrees Fahrenheit. Some advanced systems even monitor humidity levels to prevent excess moisture from causing mold or rot. But despite these efforts, spoilage remains a major risk, especially when shipments face delays at customs or ports. Watermelons may look tough, but they're shock-sensitive. A single drop can create internal bruising, which leads to fermentation inside the fruit. For this reason, they must be handled like glassware during loading and unloading. To prevent damage, exporters have developed shock-absorbing crates with foam padding. Some farms even wrap premium melons in individual mesh sleeves to protect them. But the biggest challenge comes during sea freight, where ocean waves can cause continuous rocking, leading to unseen internal fractures. To counter this, container ships use stabilizing technology to minimize vibrations. Because watermelons contain high moisture and sugar, they attract pests and fungal diseases making them a highly regulated crop for international trade. Exporters must obtain phytosanitary certificates, proving the fruit is pest-free and meets the destination country's agricultural standards. For example, shipments from Mexico to the U.S. must pass through fumigation or irradiation treatments to eliminate pests like fruit flies. Similarly, European markets impose strict quality checks on imported melons, often rejecting entire shipments if they fail visual inspections. These bureaucratic hurdles can lead to delays, increasing the risk of spoilage. Watermelon prices fluctuate dramatically due to weather conditions, harvest yields, and seasonal demand. A bumper crop can lead to oversupply, causing prices to drop, while a poor harvest can make watermelons a luxury item in some markets. To reduce losses, some producers use just-in-time logistics, coordinating shipments with retailers to match supply with demand. AI-driven market forecasting tools also help predict price trends, allowing exporters to decide whether to ship to Europe, Asia, or North America based on where demand is highest. Transporting watermelons efficiently across the world requires a constant battle against time, weight, and fragility. Traditional methods, loading trucks with stacked melons and hoping for the best, are no longer viable in a world where consumers demand perfectly fresh, unbruised fruit year-round. This has led to remarkable innovations in packaging, tracking, sorting, and transportation, each playing a crucial role in ensuring that watermelons reach their destination in pristine condition. One of the biggest problems in watermelon transport has always been physical damage. Watermelons may seem sturdy, but they're deceptively delicate. Excessive pressure, vibration, and sudden impacts can cause internal bruising, cracking, or complete rupture, rendering them unsellable. Historically, farmers and distributors relied on straw padding and manual stacking techniques to minimize damage, but this was often inefficient and inconsistent. Today, engineered packaging solutions are transforming the industry. Many exporters now use shock-resistant crates designed with foam padding, molded dividers, and air cushioning layers to absorb impacts. Instead of stacking melons directly on top of each other, they are placed into individually designed compartments that prevent rolling and crushing. Some companies have developed hexagonal packing systems, ensuring each melon sits securely without shifting during transport. In Japan, where premium watermelons can sell for over $200 each, some farmers have taken a completely different approach, growing square watermelons. By cultivating the fruit inside glass boxes, they force it to grow into a cube, which makes it significantly easier to stack and transport. While these watermelons are often considered novelty items, the concept has inspired research into growing melons in uniform, stackable shapes to optimize transport efficiency. Additionally, some exporters are exploring bio-based alternatives to plastic crates, using recyclable fiber-based materials that provide both protection and sustainability. This shift toward eco-friendly packaging aligns with global efforts to reduce agricultural waste and carbon emissions. The longer a watermelon spins in transit, the greater the risk of spoilage, bruising, 
and dehydration. A delayed shipment can turn thousands of melons into unsellable waste, costing exporters millions of dollars annually. That's why modern supply chains now integrate IoT, Internet of Things, sensors, RFID tracking, and GPS technology to monitor watermelon shipments in real time. These sensors track temperature, humidity, vibration levels, and even impact forces. If a shipping container gets too hot, above 15 degrees Celsius, or too cold, below 10 degrees Celsius, alerts are sent to logistics teams, who can intervene before the fruit is damaged. This is particularly crucial for sea freight, where temperature fluctuations and long transit times pose significant risks. In addition to temperature monitoring, RFID, radio frequency identification, tags allow retailers to track individual shipments with pinpoint accuracy. This helps in reducing waste, as stores can prioritize selling the freshest arrivals first, ensuring that no watermelon is left sitting in storage for too long. Another emerging technology is blockchain-based tracking systems, which provide an immutable, transparent record of a watermelon's journey from farm to store. This helps retailers and consumers verify where their fruit comes from, how it was stored, and whether it met food safety regulations. Blockchain is particularly useful for high-value markets, where buyers demand proof of organic certification, fair trade compliance, and cold chain integrity. Historically, selecting ripe, high-quality watermelons was a manual process. Farmers would tap the fruit, check its ground spot, and make educated guesses about its sweetness and ripeness. But today, AI-powered sorting technology is revolutionizing this step, ensuring only the best melons are shipped across the world. Imagine trying to judge a watermelon's sweetness without slicing it open. Modern sorting machines do exactly that, using hyperspectral imaging and infrared scanners to see inside the fruit, much like an X-ray at an airport security checkpoint. AI then analyzes the data, detecting hidden bruises, sugar content, and ripeness with more precision than even the most experienced farmer. These advanced scanners can detect hidden defects that might be rejected by buyers. In high-tech processing plants, AI-driven conveyor belts scan and categorize thousands of watermelons per hour, sorting them by size, weight, ripeness, and sugar concentration. This ensures that each shipment meets strict quality standards, reducing the risk of market rejections and customer complaints. One of the biggest logistical challenges in watermelon transport is maintaining optimal storage conditions while minimizing environmental impact. Since watermelons are mostly water, they are highly sensitive to temperature fluctuations and require precise climate control throughout transit. For long-distance shipments, reefer containers, refrigerated shipping containers, are used to maintain stable temperatures between 10 to 15 degrees Celsius, 50 to 59 degrees Fahrenheit. These reefers are now being upgraded with solar-powered cooling systems, reducing dependence on fossil fuels and cutting energy consumption by up to 40%. In some countries, logistics companies are testing electric refrigerated trucks, which eliminate the emissions associated with diesel-powered cooling units. These zero-emission transport solutions are particularly beneficial in regions like Europe, where carbon footprint regulations are becoming stricter. Another innovation is the use of sea freight over air freight. While some high-end markets still fly premium watermelons for freshness, most exporters are shifting to reefer-equipped cargo ships, which emit significantly less CO2 per kilogram of fruit transported. Some shipping companies are even developing biofuel-powered vessels, further reducing emissions associated with global watermelon trade. As technology advances, the watermelon supply chain is set to become even more efficient, precise, and sustainable. Researchers are already exploring automated harvesting systems that use robotic arms to gently pick watermelons, reducing labor costs and minimizing handling damage. Meanwhile, machine learning models are being developed to predict demand fluctuations, helping farmers and exporters adjust their shipping strategies in real time to avoid market oversupply or shortages. With the rise of vertical farming and controlled environment agriculture, some scientists are even experimenting with indoor watermelon cultivation, where conditions can be perfectly controlled year-round. This could eliminate seasonal fluctuations, ensuring a consistent supply of watermelons without the need for long-distance transport. From smart packaging and AI-driven sorting to blockchain tracking and eco-friendly shipping, every step of the watermelon's journey is being transformed by innovation. The result? Fewer losses, fresher fruit, and a more sustainable future for global food logistics. 
The next time you bite into a slice of watermelon, consider the astonishing journey behind it. From sun-scorched fields in China to high-tech sorting labs and ocean-crossing refrigerated ships, every watermelon travels a path carefully designed to defy time, gravity, and nature itself. Each year, 5 billion watermelons make this incredible journey, guided by AI, GPS tracking, and generations of agricultural wisdom. What was once a fragile, unpredictable trade has become a masterclass in logistics, technology, and human ingenuity. So the next time you choose a watermelon at the store, remember, you're not just picking a fruit. You're holding a triumph of global logistics, a testament to innovation, and a perfectly engineered piece of summer. What was once a fragile, unpredictable trade has evolved into a sophisticated system powered by AI-driven sorting, IoT tracking, and eco-friendly transport solutions. Farmers now use hyperspectral imaging to detect ripeness, shippers rely on real-time temperature monitoring, and retailers can track a watermelon's entire journey with blockchain transparency. Even the way we pack and stack these fruits has changed, shock-resistant crates, molded dividers, and even square-shaped melons all contribute to making transportation more efficient. And yet, the challenges never stop. Climate change, shifting market demands, and evolving trade regulations continue to test the limits of global food logistics. But as history has shown, innovation will always find a way. The next time you enjoy a slice of watermelon, consider the extraordinary effort it took to bring that fruit to your table. A journey of thousands of miles, guided by science, technology, and an unwavering commitment to freshness. If you found this glimpse into the world of food logistics fascinating, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more behind-the-scenes stories of how your favorite foods travel the world.